What's going on guys, Make Electric? It is Friday, January 4th, 2013. What we're looking at here is the, uh, quote the mainstream media, the closest pass in the history of tracking such things. A lot of you guys already know about 2012 DA-14. It is going to be here February 15th of this year. It is a 57 meter asteroid, which is roughly 187 feet. Uh, not a planet killer by any means, but it is going to be close enough in my opinion, to be sucked in by our gravity. It's going to be between the Earth and our satellites. Uh, space weather has it as 0 0.09 lunar distance. That's not even one-tenth of the way from the Earth to the Moon. Uh, there's an article on RT about it. Blasted or painted asteroid to threaten Earth in 2013. This was written months back. I did a video on this months back. This is just kind of a follow-up with the NASA JPL data uh, to avert a possible catastrophe this time set for February 2013. Scientists suggest confronting asteroid 2012 DA-14 with either paint or big guns. Interesting article here, article here from RT. There's also something from MSNBC uh, where the reporter reports uh, this is the biggest object to come near our planet in the history of tracking such things. Also, it's not a bad idea to have your affairs in order. I'll put a link to that as well, as well as spaceweather.com, where you can see the uh, the data near the bottom of the page. You can click on 2012 DA-14 to bring up the NASA JPL. I'll put a link to that as well, uh, as, as well as uh, the first video I did on this. Let's take a look at the JPL data. We are set to January 3rd, uh, current date, 3rd, 4th. I'm doing this video late at night, so let's see here. We are centered on the earth we're going to zoom in there's 2012 da14 let's go ahead and progress forward through january i will of course put a link to this jpl you could pull it up it's also probably better to watch this video full screen in hd so you can get the best uh, best view here i'm going to take the uh Object label off, planet label off, and we're going to take a look. February 15, as you can see, another one of those that you can't pull apart. Breaks the ecliptic just about evenly with our planet. Now, as it's reported, it's not supposed to hit the planet. However, it is going to be passing between our planet and our satellites. That's not very far up there, folks. So, I'm zoomed all the way in here. If you pull it up on your computer, you could probably uh, probably get a better view of it than I'm giving you here. As you can see, the ecliptic is level with our planet. We've had a lot of these in the past couple of years. A lot of close calls. This will be another one. I'm not saying it's going to hit, but uh, being below our satellites, it can certainly be sucked in by our gravity. And 187 feet would make a pretty good splash in our ocean. Or, you know, God forbid it hits land. That could just cause a mess if it land, lands in a uh, populated area. Anyway, be advised, uh, just for information only, 2012 DA-14, February 15, 2013. Incoming. Please rate this video, share it, pass it around, make people aware. Because like I said in my last video, it's my opinion that there's uh, big events coming that they know about that they're preparing for. This is why we're, we're talking about extending the uh, debt ceiling and the fiscal cliffs and all this just a little bit further. They just need to hold it up. Not saying that this is going to be the event by any means, but just one of many possibilities. I'll put links below. You guys take care. Stay safe. I'll see you on the next one.